Hi, my name's Alan and welcome to another episode of Affinity TV where we give you bite-sized chunks to keep your learning simple. Today's episode, we're going to take a quick look at how to remove spots and blemishes inside of Affinity Photo. I have this image on my desktop, so I'm just going to right click and choose to open with and choose Affinity Photo. Now, there are a couple issues I want to deal with in this picture. First is the redness of her skin, and second, of course, is those spots. Now, before I dive in and deal with any of those, I'm gonna come over to my layers pane. I'm gonna right click and choose to duplicate and rename them before and after so we can make a comparison when we're done. So, making sure I've got the right layer selected, I wanna deal with the first issue, the redness of her skin. Now. I need to apply a layer adjustment. The problem is, if I apply the layer adjustment, it's gonna affect the whole image. Whereas in this case, I only want it to affect her face. So to be able to do that, to isolate her face, I'm gonna come over to my tools on the left-hand side. I'm gonna choose the selection brush. Now I can use the left and right bracket keys to increase and decrease the size of the brush. So I'm gonna press the right bracket key to make it a bit bigger. I'm gonna click and drag and make a selection of her face. Now, if you go over, like I have in this case, I can just hold down the option key and click and remove the parts I don't want or don't need in my selection. So I don't want her top affected or her hair. So once you're happy with your selection, I'm gonna come up to the menu bar, choose layer, come down to new adjustment layer, and choose HSL adjustment. Now by default, it comes up as master. I only want to affect the red. So I'm gonna click and choose red. Now, if you play around with this and you mess up, let's say you make it look really bad, that's not a problem because you can just click on reset in the top right here and it will reset all of your settings. In my case, all I need to do is bring down the saturation a few percent, maybe seven, eight percent, I feel will work in my case. And close that, and come up to my toolbar, and choose to deselect to clear the selection. So let's have a quick look at the before and after. So just a subtle little change, but it has reduced some of the redness. So now to deal with the spots. So again, let me make sure my layer is selected. So again, I'm gonna come over to my tools on the left-hand side, and this time I'm gonna choose the blemish removal tool. Now the blemish removal tool is very simple and straightforward to use, and it works one of two ways. I can simply hover over a spot or blemish and click, or I can hover over one and click and drag and move it to a spot that I'm happy with. And again, you can use your left and right square bracket keys on your keyboard to increase or decrease the size of your brush depending on the blemish that you're dealing with. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove some of these. So you can see the Healing Brush tool does an amazing job at analyzing the surrounding pixels to remove those spots and blemishes from your images. So let's just have a quick look at the before and the after. So I'm gonna come over to my layers and I'm just gonna select these two and group these two together. So there's the before and here's the after. So you can see in just a matter of minutes, Affinity Photo does an amazing job at reducing the redness of the skin and removing spots and blemishes from your images. So there we go guys, that was just a quick look at how to remove spots and blemishes from your images inside of Affinity Photo. Thanks for watching Affinity TV and we'll see you soon on another episode.